What's up guys, happy Friday. This is James out here for Escape in the Neon. Uh, if you don't know what I'm trying to do, basically I'm trying to take my side hustles and I'm trying to double my income from my nine to five so that I can make that my full-time career. Um, today I'm running the recycle truck. I'm right behind the uh, trash truck here. So basically I'm doing trash and recycling. It's uh, definitely the worst or my least favorite aspect of this job for damn sure it's disgusting and I completely hate it <laughs> um, but hey at least I got a job I'm not complaining but it does suck so I guess that's a complaint but regardless uh, that's what I'm doing at my regular job today uh, but I'm definitely feeling good I'm feeling amped we got uh, the first Frederick Farmers Market coming up where you know I got all my permits in the off season um, basically, I'm going to try and sell coffee there. I'm going to try and sell brewed cups of coffee. So, again, today's Friday. The market's tomorrow. Let me tell you how terrible I am at this. I have no idea how much I'm going to sell the cups of coffee for yet. Uh, I'm thinking $4. That's probably what I'm going to go with. But i got to run the numbers and see exactly what I have in per cup uh, and figure that out. But, basically, we got... Um, we're gonna brew coffee. We're picking up a private label order of popcorn. Uh, so I'm gonna be selling popcorn and coffee at this market. Uh, and I'm just really excited to see how the coffee goes. Um, you know, it could be the type of thing where it doesn't sell nearly as well as I think it's going to. Uh, we're also gonna, we're supposed to have like a super rainy day tomorrow. Uh, so it'll be interesting to see how it goes at the market. I'm gonna try and get a quick video of my setup. Uh, you know, I bought all the stuff on the off season. And again, like I haven't even plugged in this coffee brewer, uh, to the generator that I plan on using. So I genuinely have no idea how this is going to go for all I know. Uh, you know, maybe the generator won't power the coffee in theory. You know, I figured out the wattage properly. I did all this and that, uh, but I haven't tested it. So we're basically going to do a dry run. Sorry for the shadows. Um, but we're going to do, or not really a dry run, we're going to do a live run uh, on Saturday. And I'm just basically going to hope for the best. Hope I can sell popcorn and coffee at the same time. Hopefully I can brew coffee. And hopefully the coffee sells. Um, so yeah, we'll see. It should be a good day though. Uh, so this evening we're going to pop a bunch of kettle corn. Because I'm still doing that myself. So we'll probably do some kettle corn. And uh, another flavor called Be My Sweet Tart. Uh, which is, you know, just kettle corn instead of, instead of regular uh, popcorn salt. I use a, uh, a salt and vinegar powder. Uh, so we got that. I got the guy that uh, created the coffee website for me. He, you know, he made the wire frame. Uh, he's begging me to, to give him some feedback on the website that he built. Um, but I'm waiting for the drop shipper that I'm getting the coffee beans from. He's going to send me labeled bags so that I can get photos from my website. Uh, so I'm somewhat on pause until that comes in the mail. And then I got to do the photographs myself. Um, and so on and so forth. So we got that. Um, I know I haven't talked much about this side of things. But uh, from the, uh, I still am on the payroll of a general contractor. Um, and I'm still helping him out. That was, you know, a job I had previously and, and me and him just got along really well, ended up becoming really good friends. And, uh, so I still basically hold the license for his company, um, and do a few things for him here and there, like, you know, searching, uh, government bid websites and that type of stuff, trying to find him some work. Uh, so anyway, so I got that going on, um, and, uh, so with that, um, we're waiting for another license to come through for that. So I'm hoping that, uh, oh, I just got a response from my website guy. Um, but yeah, so I'm excited to get that permit in too. We've made a pretty good dent in that process. So, uh, there's one more thing we got to do online for that, which is just add me into uh, responsible management of that business. Um, but yeah. And the other thing I want to reach out to him today, he owns a, uh, what he calls an island house it's uh it's a house it's in maryland obviously which is where i live but um it's right where two rivers come together it's got like an awesome little dock out there and a bunch of stuff uh, and he's been looking to sell that place for a while 
Uh, so I finally talked to him about potentially buying that spot. And he said he had two people that were thinking about buying it in May. And he said they had first dibs, basically. Uh, but if that falls through, then, then he's willing to work something out with me. Uh, so I'm going to talk to him today about that. And if they haven't said anything, it's now April 25th or something like that. 24th, I don't even know. Uh, it's the 23rd. Shit, I'm way ahead of myself. Uh, but yeah, so it's the 23rd, and I'm going to ask him if he has heard anything from them. And if not, I really want to try and set that up as an Airbnb and kind of manage the Airbnb so I have that, uh, you know, knowledge and of how to do that. And uh, also, you know, hopefully bring us both a little bit of money in. And I'd like to finagle it so I could potentially buy that house uh, because I'm pretty sure he's interested in selling. Um, so we'll see how that plays out. But but basically the update today is I'm going to pop a bunch of popcorn this evening. Um, I'm going to try and get completely ready for market. I, you know, I got to get my cups, my stirs, my lids, everything together. And again, never done anything like this before. I'm just going on the raw faith that it's going to work because, I mean, people love coffee in the farmer's markets in the morning and there's no coffee there. And, uh, you know, I'd say that market gets anywhere from like, you know, 1,000 to 1,500 people come through there on a daily basis. So uh, hopefully it goes well. But anyway, so I'm back at my favorite dog shit can here. Um, so I'm going to go empty this, but I hope you all have a great day and I'll give you an update uh, hopefully tomorrow and get some videos of what's going on with the market. So anyway, have a great one.